Hello my friends, welcome again. So here we are in our application and in this video I'm going to create the categories. So if I go and uh, register Okay, I'm going to register us with a fake filler and here is our dashboard profile And we can log out, okay. I'm going to open the VS code. And also I'm going to create the category model and migration. So in our terminal, uh, in our terminal, we need to do is run the artisan make model and it's going to create a model for the category and dash m for migration and model created successfully and also created the migration with this name okay open the vs code and now search for categories and here is our category migration we have ID and timestamps by default is coming with that command we created and I'm going to add the string for the name also the string for the slug and the same thing for for the image okay uh, save this one And we need to run now the PHP, if I open now the, sorry, the table plus. Okay. And here we have the classified ads open. We have the pilot jobs, migration, password reset, personal access token, session and users tables. If I run now the art PHP artisan migrate, yeah, it's going to create the categories table, and here it is: name, slug, image, created data, and updated at. Okay, I'm going to create another one for the subcategory. So, subcategory and here I'm going to work with a uh, page in case and if you go to the laravel.com and search for the foreign case this is how you can use it If you can use this one or uh, this one and uh, now I'm going to open that so sub categories and I'm going to add something like this just copy that one and paste it we need to change the 
the ID, not user ID, but category ID because this is going to be subcategory of the category which is the parent. Okay, so in the models we have category and this is subcategory. We are here we add in the category ID and the subcategory is of that ID we have in this category. So if I ha we have uh, electronics here with ID 1, we created the subcategories for that electronics, for example, the PC, uh, laptops, and so on. So we add that and we need to add the name as well table string for the name and for the slug also I'm going to add for the uh, image and the image is going to be nullable Okay, save, close and migrate, artisan migrate and it's going to migrate the uh, field. So now if I refresh, we have subcategories here and we have category ID and all of that. And I'm going to create one more. So artisan make model and not sub subcategory, but uh, I'm going to say uh, child category, child category. And now open that. Child category and we are going to do the same thing just change the ID here to be now this is the child category of uh, the subcategory okay and we need to add the sub category ID here and also we need to add the name and and the slug also I'm going to add the image because it's going to be sorry it's going to be a uh, no level Okay, save and uh, first we need to run the artisan command, migrate and we have an error because here we need to say Maybe subcategory ID like this. Save and already exist. Migrate, fresh, and yeah. Now we have everything okay, but I want to say, uh, do one more thing. I'm going to add the on delete cascade in our subcategory and the child category so here I'm going to say on delete cascade and it's going to delete when we delete the subcategory we are going to delete the child category of uh, the subcategory okay so I hope I uh, explain well so if we have a subcategory for uh, laptops 
and here for example we have a child category for uh, apple and uh, surface and uh, dell or lenovo okay if we delete the subcategory of laptop we can delete also we immediately delete the uh, dell or laptops and uh, Apple and Lenovo and so on the child subcategories and the same thing I'm going to do in the subcategory so if we have a category electronics and we have a subcategory for that electronic for example we have a PC laptop and so on if we delete the electronic category, we also delete the, all the electronic subcategories. Hope you understand. And now I'm going to make uh, artisan migrate flash again. And open this one, refresh. We have a categories with a structure like this and subcategories category ID name slug image and also the image is nullable okay is nullable and uh, child categories also the image is nullable okay in the next video we i'm going to create a category and i'm going to copy the this form so if i come here and open the web php in the on our, in our roads and here i say road get or resource and for example we need a user con uh, controller for that first so open the terminal and artisan make a controller and I'm going to create this inside the admin folder and say admin uh, category controller okay now here we have a cut inside the HTTP controllers we have admin and here we have a category controller and now here we can say route resource for the categories and use the category controller and import that category controller up here save and uh, now in the category controller I'm going to say to create a method for index and just return hello for now and just a test save and uh, when we have a main layout okay
uh, up layout yeah in the up layout we have so if we go here and we have a block and I'm going to change that to be a dashboard first okay so here we have a block and I'm going to say dashboard and the dashboard is named dashboard so the shrap is going to be road dashboard okay after that we have I'm going to say category and for that we have a road categories index and maybe categories like this save come here refresh we are not logging with the register because we make a artisan migrator fresh so we need to register a new user fake filler here go and register and now we here we have a dashboard if i click we go to the dashboard and here we go to the category index and we return the hello from the category controller index method Okay, and so in the next video we are going to make a CRUD for the category and see you in that video. Hope you enjoyed this one. All the best friends, all the best.